moment our relations can at best be described as normal, when, as indicated above, they can reach excellent levels as they, as they want to. In this regard, it is worth noting that strong relations between South Africa and the Federal Republic of Nigeria, as a way forward, we should consider the implementation plan that will ensure that the decisions taken over the past two days, as well as the previous binational commissions, are implemented. We would like to cooperate closely in continental and international forum, working together towards the shared objectives of a better Africa and a better world. It is given, Your Excellency, that we have a common objective of developing our continent so that as Africans, we can take our rightful position in the world. Nigeria welcomes more South African investors in infrastructure development, mining and solid minerals, value chain in agriculture, oil and gas, and energy as part of our effort toward the achievement of the objective of our vision 2020. In this regard, our countries must both work tirelessly to drive the early realization of Africa's integration agenda. In our effort to create a borderless Africa, we must, together, move this relationship beyond governments and its institutions. Nigeria remains the gateway for South Africa to the West African sub-region in terms of market access, foreign direct investment, and bilateral trade. The idea is to ensure that necessary uh, implementation structures would be established and that uh, at all levels we will have uh, point persons on both sides who take responsibility for following up on issues and ensuring that there is implementation uh, to avoid situation whereby uh, some of the uh, elements of the agreements may fall through the cracks or between the cracks, uh, as it were. The, that is the spirit in which uh, we held the, this morning's session. It was very fruitful, very productive, uh, characterized by a sense of agency. And uh, to that, uh, we are grateful to uh, our uh, His Excellency and his delegation that uh, they came uh, also with the same uh, approach and attitude and because these two countries are very strategic uh, in, in the continent of Africa. Thank you. The binational commission between Nigeria and South Africa have gone to the next level as a result of this meeting today. We have agreed that the problems of Africa, problems of development, problems of addressing poverty can only be solved by Africans themselves. And it is well known that these two countries, these two sister countries, Nigeria and South Africa, can lead the achievement of driving away poverty in Africa and solidifying our relationship, putting in cognizance and in action, addressing the issues that are militating against our growth through the Binational Commission will be the best answer and the best avenue to make effect this great noble objective of making Africa a developed continent. In a way, this binational commission ought to be a turning point whereby we irreversibly recast our relations to reflect the need for both of our nations to work closer, to 
communicate intimately and more frequently, as well as move with speed towards the implementation of all our agreements. And I thank you for your attention.